last year. I guess he started in uh, 2015. Man, just a baby. But yeah, he's been showing some. Well, I mean, I think he's been around for like a really long time. But I think he like. Well, he got actually back he and said something. He was like, "I remember playing at the first Dude, Genesis." Yeah, he's been around. He's been around for a really long time. I didn't mean to like mislead into that, but like his return to the, yeah. the scene. You know, he was playing back in the day with like guys like Balling for Life. And, you know, like the old the school, homie. the old school West Coast players. He better be here. There, come on. Talking to you, Justin. So that is not Onski, and that is not Super Flop. But so Onski <laughs> on the right, <laughs> Super Flop on the left. Um, super Flop, eh? So this. Oh my God, we should require Onski to pick a different color. Oh, this is bad. I hope this isn't as bad for the uh, the viewers, but this uh, this is one of the, it's one of the at least if if not the worst matchup in the game in the current meta. Like. Yeah, I've seen Ness do some crazy things to Kirby, but it really says something when even Fyro will play the matchup. Fyro plays the matchup. I thought, I thought Fyro would use I haven't seen him ever play Ness against Kirby. He has. Okay. Uh, I mean, when he's counterpicked, he'll play it, obviously. <laughs> well, obviously, if he, he has to, yeah. But like, like, he does go Link. Uh, yeah. But I feel like his Ness would probably do better against Kirby. Are you, he told me that... Uh, he likes Link against Pika the most, but I think he said he also likes Link against Kirby. I don't want to go But in any case, I yeah. feel like this isn't the, um, God, I feel like this is not the, the worst matchup. Uh, it's horrible, but I, just, I think it's, it's, Ness it's, can do things to Kirby. Just the yeah, camp, yeah. You know? it's very unforgiving. That's like all the matchups that people, you know, say are bad matchups, very often are just unforgiving. Yeah. Like, you have to win the neutral a lot more times. Um, you can very easily the like. But what it comes down to is really who has the better. If you consistently yeah, play better than your opponent and you have a better neutral, yeah. then that's all that matters. You just box them out the whole game. With 64, everyone's looking for the quick kill, right? Of course. But sometimes you gotta play the long game. But this, I mean, Super Flop, clearly <laughs> not one of the premier Nessus in the country. No. Uh, it's pretty, this looks like uh, maybe an early match on the loser side of a pool. I can't imagine they're still on, this is still winner's side. Yeah, I don't, it, I don't see This pool's running just super slow. Yeah, I don't know but why. Onski, pretty solid command of that matchup. You have to do some pretty tricky things with Ness to get in on Kirby. I mean, we have all seen that up tilt. We know what it's capable of. But not everyone knows how to combat it, how to really work your way around it. Right. Super Flop clearly does not have that information yet. yet. But we'll see if we ha he has some kind of adjustment here. He did, he did take a stock, just saying something. I think, I don't know. I don't know what I was gonna say about this. <laughs> it's just it's just Ness Kirby. Yeah, it's Ness Kirby. It's rough. <laughs> um, we've seen some some solid Ness Kirby in the Nova Weeklies. I know Kristoff from Northern Virginia, very good at this matchup. And Ness can okay. do some things to Kirby, but Super Flop probably can't do much to Kirby. Oh. All right, so that was not okay. That was not how you edge guard Ness. Um, mm. Wow, that was a quick shield. Double up B will work. Okay. Keep it simple. Yeah. yeah. Kirby, I mean, that's why it's so bad though, because yeah. Kirby can just go out there. He doesn't even need to. Like, honestly, he could have stayed on the stage. Yeah. And covered all, or grabbed the ledge and covered all of Ness's options. That was so close. Got hands linking with me. Up tilt. Oh, gets up tilt. Dude, that was really good. He it's a back throw. Dashed in, dashed back. That's a great grab. back. But, yeah, wow. Honestly, he's got a pretty good recovery. And PK fire, not gonna do it from. Looked like he made the arc on that up be a little too. Yeah, he dropped uh, a little wide. too low as well. Ooh. All right. He fired the grab. Super Flop just gained a couple fans right here. 
You're going to see that in the combo contest, uh, Smash Con 2017. Oh, oh, he went for the baseball bat. I, like, I can't tell at this point. Like, he's just kind of saying, screw, screw it. Yeah, I mean, I think he's trying. I yeah, he's probably he's just not a you know, nice, high level player. Not, not experienced yet, but hopefully. We aren't doing a good job of helping them learn from us. Well, it's just, just don't, Kirby. don't play you the matchup. You have to watch the matchup. Yeah. Uh, you have to plat camp. You have to get your down air tech chases like, you know, set. I mean, really what he should be doing here is baiting out, yeah, baiting out approaches from Onski and catching them with an up tilt or a DJC up tilt. Yeah. And he's just, ooh, oh, nice finish from Onski. And the handshake. Um, yeah, he could have he could have baited on Seattle a little bit more.